Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Catherine. And we are getting ready to take on the boss of the, uh... I never remember the name of this place. I want to say Twisted Corridor, but I don't think it's the name of it. But, yeah. We're getting ready to take on the boss here, and in my opinion, one of the creepiest bosses in the entire game. Who is it? it sounds like a kid. He, he can't be, can he? This boss... Well, I'll get in more than a second. Oh, damn it. Is that exhaustion I sense? Sit down and rest. Oh, man. Welcome, little lamb. I see you've survived. Oh, you're doing amazingly. The next trial will be the last one on this floor. I've been through so much shit already. Nothing is gonna scare me off now. This is the 14th question. Which is easier on you? To be loved or to love? To love, definitely. So that's it then. That's my last one. Now you're almost there. I'll say goodbye to you here. Only a very small number of sheep have ever reached the cathedral. In this century, you're the first. Ugh. I hear there are more holy stairs with red carpet at the top of the cathedral. Get there. But don't let go of what's important to you. If you can, then you'll be free. It's important to me. I don't know. But I'll worry about tomorrow, tomorrow. In any case, I'm getting the hell out of here. Now hurry up and take me up there. Well, I'll lead you to the next trial. Wait for me, Catherine. Oh, dear. Now this next boss has some noob killer uh, moments. And let me just tell you, this boss sucks until you know exactly what to do. It's so bad that I actually remember most of what to do here. So, yeah. This isn't going to be as funny as the previous videos were, or as annoying as I'm sure many of you probably think, but still, I remember mostly what to do. I hope. <laughs> this is the final area for tonight. The glowing black hole blocks suck in anything placed on top of them. Avoid stepping on them. Once you pass this area, you'll reach your final destination, the cathedral. Yep. Let's do this. Vincent Brooks. How do you feel? Who's there? Run. The shadow of the has a wing. It's the killer. Do not die. Edge. Edge. Yeah, this boss, noob killer number one. Yeah, that will kill you if you're in front of it. <laughs> and like I said, there's really only one way to get through this, and you better remember it. Or know it, or be able to figure things out extremely quickly. This is number two. Alright, I got it. Ah, oh, crap. Let's try that again. Yeah, you gotta do this. I got it. Very fast. All right, I got it. I can't die here. God damn it. Vincent, stop doing that. All right, I got it. Whoa! Whoa! All right, I got it. There we go. Ooh. That's about the worst part. You can't escape! This is only bad if you don't know what to do here. Otherwise, it's pretty easy, actually. But yeah, this place drops really fast. And you see the solution? Oh, by the way, we're not even at the difficult part. No, 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 this is the easy part. My friends. If only this was the hard part. No, no, no. You just gotta, you know, go with what will. I can't use the middle thing, so you gotta, you know, use the different blocks and try and figure out inventive ways to get up here. Like I said, I only know this because I spent so long doing this before. Right, I got it. That I remember basically everything about this. No, literally, I probably did this over 70, 80 times. 
I can't move. Oh yeah. Yeah, he makes everything dark. Hope you've memorized what to do here, otherwise you're gonna have some fun. I see ice. Rather not, yeah. <laughs> There's a black hole block. I gotta take this slow, I'd rather not fall in. Your sin won't just disappear. Okay. Push that over. Your sin won't just There should be a spring block somewhere. There it is. I gotta get rid of that. I don't want that. There we go. Don't fall into that thing. Okay. Go over here. Alright. Alright. Okay, we gotta get rid of that black hole thing there. If we wanna get over there, which we do. That's using the old noodle. Okay. Go over here. Okay. I can't see things. There we go. Now, the only reason I know how to do this is because, like I said, I've done this many times before. Push that. Pull that out here. Pull. There we go. There's no turning back. Push or pull. Up here. There's no turning back. All right, I got it. Go around. All right, I got it. Okay. There we go. There's no one around. Oh, I'm sure there is. But I'm gonna find it if not. Okay. Over here. Over here. And we're basically in the home stretch. Trust me, though. If you don't know where you're going, this is hell. A little more. Absolute hell if you don't know where to go. You! You are... I... I don't want to die! Where... Where's Catherine? Catherine? Wait a second... That voice... You're... You're Steve, aren't you? Huh? How do you know my name? Um... Well... I'm Steve Doholm. I'm a dentist. I see! That voice! You're Vincent, aren't you? <laughs> what a twist of fate. It looks like I'm cursed. You figured something out? I've been cursed by Catherine. <laughs> How do you get a curse from that? <laughs> Don't you get it? You're cursed too. It's revenge for betrayal. Revenge? Catherine, you're talking about is... Okay, so Steve is dead. I gotta say, mostly his fault though. <laughs> but yeah, that really sucks if you don't know what you're doing. At, at all. It sucked bad enough and I knew what to do. The spiral corridor certainly held no twists for you, did it? Congratulations on a perfect climb. Ah, spiral corridor, not twist. Yeah, anyway. Oh, this is gonna be interesting. This day is going to be interesting. Man, I need some 
sleep. Nightmares just keep coming. Mm -hmm. I had a dream where I felt dead. I struggled and struggled, like I was being chased by something crazy. Mm -hmm. Yo, you listening? Hey, Orlando. Man, we've had these crazy dreams every night. So how come we can't remember them clearly? Huh? Now that you mention it, I just... I can't shake this feeling. Uh, I can't remember. The series of mysterious male deaths continues with another gruesome discovery this morning. Local dentist Steve Delhomme, age 42, was found dead at his home. His wife, who he'd been feuding with, found him dead in his sleep this morning. Like the other victims, his body was in an atypically weakened state, inconsistent with known causes of sudden death. Can't be. Hey, uh, you all right, man? Whoa, that dead guy on the nose just now, I know that guy. He lived in my neighborhood. The police came this morning? Oh, God, it was so loud. That sounds like a bad way to start the morning. That bastard was cheating on his wife with a younger woman. The entire neighborhood knew because he bragged about it to everyone. What a creep. You gotta feel bad for the kids in that situation. Oh, they didn't have any kids. But still, what a horrible man. Hey, what is it? We met last night. In my dream. Huh? Met who? I remember now. It was him. He died in my dream. Him? The guy in the news? <laughs> that's crazy talk, man. What did he say? Wait, that's right. It's, it's starting to come back to me now. He said it was a curse. Because he betrayed someone. Hey, cut that out. You're trying to tell me he was killed in his dreams or something? You are fucking crazy. Well, maybe not. Think about it. The rumor? Maybe it's true. The dreams we've been having every night. Did you honestly just say that? How does this tie in with betrayal? I'm the one that got betrayed. Yeah. Sorry. Enough bullshit. We just can't think straight because we're too damn tired. We wake up all bleary-eyed and the world's full of rumors. Then we can't sleep because all this crazy shit's stuck in our heads. Y you're probably right. Exactly. I didn't betray anyone. I was the one who was betrayed. So why is... Fuck. I didn't mean to bring that up. I was... I was just thinking. Eh, it's all stupid. Yeah. <sighs> Man. What about you? You dumped the girl you're cheating with? Actually, I was gonna go talk to her after this. <laughs> It'll be a horrible date, but I've made up my mind. I'm ending it. I see. When this is all done, I'm gonna propose to her. To the one I know I love. Of course, I haven't bought a ring yet. <laughs> the ring can come anytime. Good luck. <laughs> yeah. We gotta give it to Orlando. He, he's really trying to make us feel better, but, uh... I'm still not quite 100% on this plan, Vincent. I gotta tell you. Really not. Don't think it's gonna work. Not the way I brought you up. Hey, what's up with Vincent over there? Just leave him alone. Don't get messed up and all that. Oh, hey, there's something I wanted to tell you. Check this out. Yesterday, I finally became a man. Got rid of my V-card. Boom! Uh, wait, back up. With who? Take a wild guess. It shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> Erica? Yep, bingo. Sorry I got to her first, man. <sighs> Seriously? Yeah, but there was something weird about it. You know, I can't really explain it. It's probably just because it was my first time. Maybe, you know, just my imagination, but... So what happened to John? Are you come here by yourself? <laughs> yeah, he's not coming today. He, uh, looked pretty bad earlier. <sighs> I see. Kind of weird everyone's tired all the time, huh? Vincent's infected us, damn it. Uh, so you see, I mean, there's nothing wrong with you. <sighs> so then, there's someone else, isn't there? I've been meaning to tell you all this time, but I couldn't. 
I had a lot of things on my mind, and then you came along. I guess I was trying to escape reality. Do you like her more than me? Look, I'm sorry. She's someone I really need to hold dear. So. Hold dear? Wait, so does that mean you're already dating her? I'm sorry. like we've been doing. <laughs> well, you might not mind, but I do. Why? You want to know why. <sighs> to be totally honest, she's pregnant with my child. <gasps> so, I've decided to marry her. Y you're joking, right? I I'm fine with that. I just want to be your girl. This is so... <sighs> no way. I, I, I couldn't live like that. I can't see you anymore. You can't see me, but no. Please don't. <laughs> oh shit, she's crying. I guess she really meant all those things she said. Damn it, Vincent. You betrayed her feelings. You took advantage of her. Look, it was a mistake, all right? <laughs> mistake? I'm not good looking. I, I don't have any money. So no matter how you spend it, I'm no good for you. You're still young, so you probably just went with the flow. So... It wasn't like that! Look, I know I'm being a real jerk, but we need to end this. I'll do anything else you ask of me. <laughs> anything else? What else is there? I'm going to die. Please don't say stuff like that. Just... Catherine, wait! Hey, Catherine, you okay? Do I look like I'm okay? Take it back. I... I can't do that. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I'll do anything. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> you are really pissing me off! You don't get it. I could do anything you want me to. I'm protecting you! Why are you trying to leave me? Ugh. Are you an idiot? Yeah, I'm an idiot. <laughs> Shit. My spleen. Don't you see you're making a huge mistake? You really, really should not leave me. Even still, I... Dude, what's up with that? That was Vincent's voice, right? Oh man, I hope he's okay. But that just means I want to be even less involved. I told you that was not a good idea, Vincent. But would you listen? No, <laughs> you had to be the great two shoes. That's what you get for. Dude, she said she was okay with being a freaking mistress, dude. 